Hello and welcome to Bolt UIX. In this video, I will show you how to make date and time picker using Flutter. Let's start with our stateful widget. Here we have a future variable which holding date time and also another future variable holding the time of day. And also we have a two string, one for storing date, another for storing time. Here we have a text view which will be display our selected date and time right here. And also we have a two buttons like date picker and time picker. If I pick date button which will be trigger this one on press. In this on press we have a show dialog picker. And also I just passing context to this function. We have already future variable selected date. We just simply calling show date picker, which is the inbuilt function. If you want to know more about this one, you can simply control and click this one. You can get some idea about this widget. In this widget, we need to pass context and you can also set your helper text. You can change this text. Initial date. In, in this case, I just want to show my current date. So I just using the date time dot now which help us to show current date and time like this you can also do more constraint like you can say this year limit in my case i just want to show year within the 2000 and 2050 means you can simply adjust this constraint right here and you can also do more customization about your brand theme in my case i just want to be show my primary color that's why I'm using this primary color to the primary. If you want to change the primary color means I just simply change the color to green. Control is to save. You can see the primary color is changed to green in color. Likewise, you can change the on primary color currently white. So the text of color will be white in color. If you want to change some other color or black means you can simply change the on primary color color dot black which help us to change this color heading color heading text color likewise you can change on surface on surface which help us to change this surface text color here you can see the date calendar text view all the element will be changed to this color on surface if you want to change green in color control s to save you can see this color changed to green in color like finally our value will be stored this selected date in this selected date we just getting the value we simply check the value is not equal to null means we just going to be convert value dot milliseconds in sepoch we just getting from this date picker we are going to be convert this value to formatted output just control click this one you can get this function which help us to convert epoch time to month day and year i just simply select this one and you can see this month day year likewise you can convert your formatted output and finally we just storing this value to date here we using set state so this value will be updated to the respective variable which used in our text view and also we can get some error to this picker in case if we got some error means we can get this error from right here likewise we just going to be called this show time picker if i click this pick time this function will be called with context here we using show time picker show time picker is one of the inbuilt function used to display time picker like this in this case i just using context initial time and also we sing builder which help us to change our branding theme here i just using the primary color is red so the primary color all this red in color here i just using the green in color of my surface color so the surface color is changed to green in color in this case i just changing all as red in color so here is our output and also finally we holding this value to selected time 
if the selected time got value means we just going to be apply this ht value dot hours value dot minutes this value will be going to be update our string variable which also will be updated to our text view i just 5:28 am if i click okay means this value will be updated from this text view this is all about the date and time figure guys you can get this source code from my git link see you guys in next video